Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today we're starting off with a new family, the McCombrinks. I hope I'm saying that correctly because I don't think I am. This young lad's name is Kenny and yes they are based off of some of the South Park characters. I just couldn't help myself but um, it's not like I can exactly copy it anyway regardless. This is young Kenny. Um, so Kenny uh, lived with his mom, brother and sister in first in, I want to say Strangerville, but it's not Strangerville, is it? Is it Strangerville? I don't know, that one. They lived there. Um, they weren't very well off, can I say? Um, their dad took off when they were very young. Apparently he liked drinking more than he liked hanging out with them. Mom worked two jobs and some other freelance stuff to try and keep everyone going. The, his older brother really, um, he felt that it was his mom's fault that dad left. He idolized his dad and um, also ended up going down the same route as dad, sadly. Uh, but when mom died and Kenny became old enough, he grabbed his sister Karen and he moved to the city where he had gotten a job in manual labor. I think it's manual labor. Yeah. And he also does a few part-time things to um, get another income. This is his sister Karen and she's absolutely gorgeous. If you're wondering why she's so small with the no, with the CC, it's because she is has the um, preteen mod. So she is preteen with a mod, and that is why she is so small. Now Karen is a beautiful soul. She is really uh, a kind sim, good sim, but. She really loved her dad, even though with all his faults and all, and she f always felt like she should have d done more to try and keep him to stay with him. And somehow felt like it was her fault that she couldn't convince him to stay, like she was never good enough. And therefore she has a bit of a, a problem. Um, her lifetime aspiration has turned into the serial romantist one. Um, like she's trying to find attention where it's not supposed to be found. So she is a little bit, um, what's the right word I'm looking for? It's not tricksy. She's feisty, she's feisty. But yeah, um, so hopefully, I hope she finds love eventually. But um, yeah, I don't know if she will actually find what she's looking for in the end. Um, but yeah, so that is young Karen and uh, she lives with her brother Kenny, loves him to bits, sometimes very annoyed with his presence. Um, and then they also have a puppy whose name I completely forgot. I can't remember the dog's name. What was the dog's name? The dog's name is Gerald. Yeah, Gerald. So yeah, that's the introduction to the family. So let's get into game. Okay, and so they live in the city, like I mentioned, um, Kenny got a job and then he moved out here. Um, so if you were wondering, um, Karen is neat and cheerful and Kenny is a freegan, good and clumsy. I made him clumsy as a nod to the, the South Park reference because Kenny always dies. Well, let's hope he doesn't die in this case because even though we really do love the brother, um, what was his name? Kevin. Kevin, Karen and Ke Kenny. Yeah. Um, even though we love uh, Kevin with all our heart, he is not the best role model, I do believe. I think um, Kenny is trying his absolute best to make sure that he can give his sister a better life. Um, so what I'm going to do here now is... What the hell is this? random stink going on here oh my word <laughs> okay we'll see if that stays oh gosh I went the wrong way we'll see if that stays okay so anyway as you all can see here uh, there's this little room here um, 
don't mind it I'm just I'm gonna delete everything here I basically made like for every single sim in this world because I already placed a bunch of sims I made like a basic room for them to you know live in because uh, I had a sim that died of the conditions and I, and I didn't want to redo that so no man. so let's empty out this place I'm probably gonna have to give them a bit more money as well while we try and figure out the basic shape of this place so I wanted to what is this gourmet fruitcake uh, okay oh, great I can't delete it so basically um, in this city I wanted to uh, how can I do you have it now yeah you do okay I wanted to base the city off of like I don't know maybe Tokyo or something since that's a really big city so I'm gonna try and cre recreate um, homes that are in that style um, the basic like the basic like um, can I say Tokyo apartment so it might be a little bit cramped we'll see how it turns out I have a few reference images I'm gonna put up so yeah we're gonna go for something basically like that uh, bathrooms need to be split up um, also there should be a lot of like storage space cupboards and things like that is what I'm getting at what I'm seeing so we'll go for that first I'm just gonna get some lights to light up here because I can't see a thing okay so let's just put in some lights in here I think we're gonna focus mostly on like the basic apartment this episode so no furnishing um, like example if you move in the city and you move into an apartment there is a few basics already there like there will be cupboards there will be lights there will be doors and usually the place is already painted or whatever in the way that it needs to be um, so we're gonna go for that okay let's see um, let me just get my bearings quickly I have no idea what that stink is over there and I don't know if I want to keep it oh this um, this apartment is always also supposed to have like rats <laughs> And I, I might have like <laughs> had a fit and got rid of them, which I was not supposed to do. So I might put in a few holes with the debug in the end. I'll see. <laughs> so I'm gonna do this. If at the moment it doesn't immediately make sense, it will eventually. I'm wondering here, I wanted to make this space to put in some of those big closets that came with get together but I'm wondering if I should just instead of that build an actual like uh, in cupboard room or something like that where we can maybe put up some of those um, what was it from Strangerville and those those storage items I use them to death in all garages and storage things but I just think it will look better than the um, the the cupboards is it cupboards but yeah, I think we'll, we'll think about it and maybe we can put like the rat hole in there <laughs> where it doesn't annoy me that much, like there's a rat in the storage unit. <laughs> I think that'll be fun. Okay, so here, let's um, go here. I think about here is fine, like this. Yeah, so that the windows aren't cut up and then I can use this space here like I said, they have all these inbuilt um, cupboards, linen cupboards and stuff. So um, that trick I use with the, the cupboards is going to come in handy here. Okay, so then also we should probably, how many like here? I 
think like this big maybe yeah and then we have to go to this side now okay so uh, if we're gonna go off of like is it a um, basic homes like uh, Japan I would say that we need a why do you call it a goikin? Go 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 I'm, I'm horrible at this. Let's see if I can maybe find something to tell me what it sounds like. So I'll use the um, I'll use the the platform tool and then just sink this in. I think. And then the bathroom might be a little bit tricky. Let me just have a quick view at this. Okay, so I got Google Translate here. It's a genkan. Okay, so uh, according to Google Translate, this is how Genken. A Genken. I don't think that's Genkan. Yeah, a Genkan sounds better. Anyway, regardless, that's apparently how you say it. So yeah, um, let's just uh, continue on here. So bathroom, toilet needs to be separated. Um, what about right here? This could be the bathrooms. Um, yeah, I think so. So let's go up to here. Like this. I think this will work nicely. Then we separate off these. Like that. Toilet separate from washing area and also um, se completely separate from the bathing area is how I see it so then now I have to fit in another room here and this is gonna be the living room so let's go um, I want this basically to be the room but I don't like that small space over there should I maybe like go I don't know, like this some more space here like that could work uh, I also want to do this because I had an idea about that what if I will this be too weird like this might be end up being the shape that we use not completely into it though also I wanted to put like the this here so does this then what if I do this then room might be tiny but that's to be expected I mean that's usually the case in cities anyway, isn't it? Yeah, I think that's good. We'll see if we can make it work like this. Okay, so next up. Um, don't worry about that. I'm going to be editing that with a tool mod. Um, in fact, let's get to that as we are right now so first I'm gonna do is click on this room one down and we're gonna get rid of this um, yeah like that I think that's good then let me just go see if we can figure this out oh, never mind I think okay over, over buddy you need to come here oh no it is floating that's fine i'll use a little more to lower it down as well come on move over move over move over move over 
I think here is good, maybe a bit more. Yeah, I think that's good. Let me just see. Are you now away from the wall? No, it's still in the wall. It's not going through the wall. Good, okay. So then what we need to do is go down, go closer. Then we're gonna go to, we're gonna say elevate. I'm really sorry guys, for some apparent reason, my footage was like, I don't know, it just stopped. Um, so annoyingly, I'm sorry to say that I lost that footage. Luckily, I noticed it in times to stop and start recording again. Um, but I ended up using uh, minus 0.3 on both of these to make sure that they are on the floor and not floating in the air where the platform is started. Okay, so let's get on with it. Um, I actually have to get a move on because like in 30 minutes our power is going to go out. Lovely South Africa um, having load shedding again. So yeah, let's let's see how fast I can do this and if I can manage to do this correctly. I'm gonna I want why? What's happening? Um What is happening? You realize this is a, a, a platform friendo. Let me just go no it's it is these. Why aren't you working? I'm gonna lose my patience. Why isn't it working? What are these? Are these? Yeah, it, it, they're all for platforms. Why am I? You know what? You know what? Hanflieg. I'm not. Um, I don't care. I don't care. What's this? Concrete. Let's pour some concrete. I think actually this is concrete, so I don't think it's gonna make much of a difference. But yeah, there we go. Um, before I murder something, let's go with this color. Why did I turn that way? I have no idea. Let's see. You know what? I actually think I'm gonna go dark. I'm gonna go dark. Room, 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 room. Yeah, like that. And then I'm gonna need tiles. I'm gonna use uh, there was an in the city tile, but I really like this one. Should I use this one? Let me see here. Yeah, why not? Keep it. Um, I'm gonna use these. Maybe I should use brick outside. Okay. Like I have a, a, an idea that brick might be the way to go, but then like very nice brick. Like this. And then I can't change those, so what I'm gonna do is get the same brick to match in. Yeah, like that. Okay. And then maybe some more tile for in here, but which ones? This. What is this? I think I'm gonna go for this one. Bathrooms, and then maybe for this space as well. 
the like I want to call it a washing room it's gallery I don't know paint uh, here I'm gonna go buy snowy escape go back to this we're gonna go for the darker color why I have no idea why I just decided it now funnily enough here and here and then you yeah, and that brown this and this an object affected by this action can be moved to the household in is that why that's happening well luckily I have this wonderful mod from Twisted Mexi that lets me allow doing anything I want so guess what you're doing it that also reminds me now I can do this oh, bugger snowy escape take it off please give me this nothing to change let me just see okay so it's putting it on but it is the right color what about the really dark one I like the really dark one but let's go for the yeah the one that it is on now because it's matching the what do you call this concrete go closer maybe a bit change the concrete color this is kind of bluish black you know what I'm gonna stick with this it doesn't match completely but I don't care and then always you have to take this off because it can mess up stuff and then I'm gonna put in what's that? Snow escape, please. Thank you. Let me just do a quick save. Can't believe the door didn't want to delete because I oh, didn't want to paint the. What am I even saying? I can't believe the room didn't want to be painted because an immovable object was being threatened to delete. Like, what? What? I mean, why would painting a wall remove an immovable object? I don't know. I mean, you know what? Don't try and figure it out because it's not going to work. Let's just do this. And here as well. Yeah, like that. And then we're going to go. Give me back, please. Stop taking it away. Let's go tile. The dark one. So that's painted, I think. I painted everything I wanted to paint. Yeah, cool. Okay, and then next up is lighting. I'm gonna remove these. Darken up the rooms. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Love that song. You just change the lighting as possible. We'll figure out what that stank is. I don't understand that, but okay. Um, let's go over here. By lighting and going for the darker ones, right? Yeah. Well, semi-darker. In the kitchen. Okay, slow as said something <laughs> oh very slow um we're gonna put one here yeah one in the room this tiny room and one in this 
this room and then the other ones is going to be this one oh wait before I do that maybe I should have uh, put in the doors Okay, so these lights are going to be placed randomly. I'll figure out the heights and stuff when I get there. For now, I'm just going to do this. Like a mad person, just placing everything randomly everywhere. Like this, and then this has a light, so we'll put... Oh, wow. Uh, that size. <laughs> One here. Oh, that's wrong. <laughs> Giant light. I'm gonna figure out this later on. I'm gonna do it off camera rather. Because um, I don't wanna be fiddling with things like that when I'm basically running out of time. I uh, also want to place some pillars which might seem odd, but there is a reason for it. That's not only just decorative. I like how the paint makes it look like there actually is pillars in this place. So yeah, luckily for that. Um, one here. One here. Should I then maybe put one here as well? Just for <laughs> fun of it, I almost said something completely different that involves giggles. Plain old wood one. I wanted to go for something a little bit more pretty like this, but I feel like this is like, um, you know, basic apartment worthy. Let's see. What does it look like? work yeah compared to I really like that one but I want this to feel like basic like um, you know, it, it comes with the apartment so let's put you here oh, come on oh, wait what Delayed reaction much? Um, doors. I'm gonna put you here. And you here. Okay, so this might now sound, oh, sound, seem very odd. What I'm about to do, no, not there. For the bathrooms but these doors even though they are two tile doors they work as a one tile they just slide into the other space so if i place them the right way around your sim will still use it like a one tile door okay i've tested this theory um these doors i'm gonna use here okay point outside please Okay, yeah, and I've decided instead of using a closet, I'm gonna be using uh, this for like a utilities. Maybe I should then put in a paper door because you can see through these. combination of the two because I know there is a I'm gonna have to remove the snow escape sorry about that um, in the city one where is it oh, not in the city in the um, get together these Go 
gosh, my computer is so slow right now. Like that. And then inside, we can have space to pack things. We can cut it off. Probably should. storage unit in there I might take out one door too I'm, I'm not certain yet but yeah so that's that and then next up what we have to do is add in I wanted that um, put on this again I want this to count like as part of the apartment. Going with that one, yeah. So, also, why doesn't this room have a room, like a window? What's wrong with you? Okay, it's on that line. Like this. We'll give her a window. Because it's dumb that it doesn't have one. Okay, like that, and then basics, basics would be counters, toilets, that kind of thing, you know, definitely using the, this toilet, the smart one that doesn't use toilet paper, it rinses you. <laughs> Uh, bathtub. Yeah, we'll use this one. Bathtub's gonna be on this side. What the hell? Why are you being weird? Oh, huh. she didn't like that. Yeah. And then we also want that open shower piece. Gonna put it here by the door. Like that. And then do does that. Um, I do want to put in the sink, but I, I first need counters. There was a... That bath equipment would that come with it or do you need to bring your own these bucket and food stool I feel like they would come with the place because it's like a necessity for the showers or whatever do I have my quarter top facing on no I did yeah never mind so I'm gonna put that up there then we're going to the kitchens This one or this one? I think I'm gonna go for the darker one. Put you here. Put you here. Just let me make sure because sometimes even though they snap. Yo, look at that. Why are you doing that? Don't do that. This one isn't. Why are you being like that? I knew you were gonna do that. Sink from Snowy Escape. Which one will we put in? I like a basic grey sink to do. Should I make them white? Yeah, I think that. Okay, cool. And then we can start with these. 
Okay, so I want a corner piece here, a normal piece here, space for the oven, another corner piece here, and another. No, come on, you. And then an end piece. Like that. And then on this side, we want a normal piece right here. And then we want, I think, another end piece here. Since that will be the space for the. Oh, you know what I wanted to do here? <laughs> Move you over to hide the fridge. Why? I don't know why. I just wanted to do it like this. Close it off a bit more. So the fridge will go in there. And then we just put this back on because it's off again. Aha, uh -huh. no, not echo. Thank you. Um need a sink in here as well. We're gonna go for the this time the grey one right here so you can watch out while you're washing dishes I feel like that would be an uh, acceptable thing to do let's go back to this weird one because I'm looking for uh, surfaces where's that shelving unit this is not the one I was thinking about why isn't it here? This is so weird. Okay. No shovel. Let me just find it. This thing. Why wasn't it there? Splash. Are you sure you're the same color? Because I don't feel like you are. I'm gonna go darker it doesn't actually seem correct let me bring it down a bit as well like that yeah okay and then also I feel like this thing would oh, sorry I have to take this off yeah this thing go here it's actually kind of funny because most of the places I've been moved into they usually provide a, like an oven for you and then in other places they don't have an oven in and then they're like it's not part of the um, deal I don't know is it like that in all countries do when you rent a place do you expect to see an oven in there or a stovetop or are you expected to bring your own because I don't know I feel like I want to put an oven in because most of the time there's an oven in the places where you go you know but I don't know if this is just me or if this is actually a thing so I'll, I'll think about it I might have them buy their own oven to put in the place um, like they need to buy their own fridge so yeah that's that I'm also gonna put in a fire alarm as standard um, where I'm, I'm gonna put it right here and also a thermometer but obviously you have a choice if you want to use it or not and I don't think they're gonna have the funds to do that but I might have to um, oh my gosh yeet I might have to um, get them one of those little, what was it, uh, from the snow escape pack as well, that little heater thing, yeah, okay, and then definitely that would be 
in the house and not separate would be closet space gonna have to go for the darker one because I don't think any of the other will work in here but if if there's a problem with it I'll just change it um, oh gosh Sorry about that, I had to cheat up the money again. Um, what? Don't take things from my hand. Um, but yeah, so like that. And then maybe in here I'll do that one little, like uh, give them a little space to work with things here. Um, okay, done. So, um, I'm racing the clock here, I'm just going to finish up with this, and then next episode we can basically start moving in their things. Um, come on. Gosh, why are you so slow? My game is being a real big baby at the moment. Like seriously, what are you doing? Why are you being a big baby? Okay, so let's go for these. I want... <coughs> Sorry about that. I want this one, I think. I'm gonna go for you in white. Put you up here, and then I'm gonna pick you in white. Slot in, please. Boom. Let me just reposition this. Oh, you know what? It's actually fine like that. It's not sticking through anywhere. Yeah. Okay, and then I should probably put a light in here as well. I mean. I also wanted to do the outside lights because that would also be part of the home, right? I want like a plain old, any plain, nope, you don't get no plain old nothing. I will go for these then. I'll put one here, one here, and then maybe just one here. Just see. Well, that's enough light. Might end up being moved up because I wanted to place something there. And the house is nice and light. Yeah, I think this is great. Let me just think if there's any other things. Um, maybe like a, a pot. The apartments have trash cans, but I'm gonna add one anyway because those trash cans drive me freaking crazy. And I'm not lying. Like, half the time they won't clean up plates because they're like, there's no, no sink in the um, apartment or there's no um, trash can in the apartment when there specifically is. So, I you know what? Shush you. You will have one inside as well. I don't care. You will not continue on with that nonsense I'm gonna place you right here trash cans okay <laughs> okay so the basic gist of the apartments is done so they then they can just move in their things you know okay do you, do you have like a should I do it in a darker one everything else is kind of dark here isn't it would make sense yeah okay cool 
like that and then they can put in their laundry oh yeah and then of course like what's a washing room without oh and you know what else <laughs> I'm like yes I have everything covered and then I'm like oh wait there's 10,000 things I forgot like these in gray please right over there yeah and then of course this would be with to find a way to make it work mm. laundry day I'm freaking being blind today I don't know I want you in metal please I'm gonna have to make you fit here I might use the tool mod to do this better. Maybe at the edge. No, I don't want it at the edge. Come on. Oh, come on. Stop it. I know it's possible. Stop it. I might use a tool mod to yank it in a bit more. Maybe, I don't know, can I do it in the, the black one? Yeah, that fits a bit better. Yeah, that fits a lot better. But yeah. And on that note, thank you everybody for watching. I really hope you enjoyed the build so far. And we can start furnishing them up in the next episode. I'm going to try and keep it like might have to use like debug to get like used beds and things like that since um the the whole idea of the story is that they they aren't very wealthy they're actually quite struggling a bit i mean i think if i remember correctly the the manual lab, labor career um you only work saturday and sunday which is crazy to me but okay um but yeah so he'll probably do like side jobs as well to try and keep things going oh yeah and before i forget i'm also changing up my schedule from now on it's going to be once a week on wednesdays instead of two times a week um it might change like change back it might not we'll see we'll see how it goes thank you all for watching and have a very lovely day bye bye